Let me introduce you to Andrew from SeaTech. Andrew, welcome. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Lovely to meet you too. Tell me about SeaTech and the products that you guys bring to the public. Okay. SeaTech um, was uh, started in the north of England in uh, 1983. Uh, we started actually making burglar alarm equipment that uh, we developed into the uh, nurse call market, uh, built up the business and basically sell, selling mainly into distribution and to uh, specialist installation companies. Um, from that we went into the fire business and we've become very well established. I think we're the largest independent manufacturer of fire alarm equipment in the, in the UK now. Um, and uh, back in 2011 we moved into a fabulous new factory next door to Heinz Baked Beans in Wigan actually. Um, which uh, 95,000 square feet, fantastic facilities for manufacturing and also for training and the like. Um, and we've carried on investing in R&D ever since. Well, you've always got your lunch sorted. That's the main thing. Um, tell me about that natural progression then. You say, you know, it's come from burglar alarms and, and you've ended up here. Was that a natural progression? Um, the, the problem we found with the burglar alarm business was that it was, there was no loyalty. Whereas in the fire alarm business, maintenance and making sure things are actually going to work is taken far more seriously. So you can build your business, build your relationships, and really we, we, build, we put a lot of store on relationships with our customers. Look at our Google reviews and you'll see people think we're great. There's no loyalty amongst thieves anymore, is there? That's the trouble. Um, no, listen, tell me about what you guys are showcasing here at FireX. Okay, well... One of the main things we've done with is we've got our analog addressable system, which uh, is uh, got our own protocol called CAST, um, and this is now being certified by the BRE, um, so we can actually sell it, which we've not been able to do up until recently. Um, but we've also got our new Hush Pro system, which is on the wall behind you, and this is a self-contained fire alarm system for residential properties. Okay, now he's over there now. Um, it's a self-contained system for residential properties. It's a grade C system under BS5839 part six. Um, and it's got several advantages. Um, for management of false alarms, reduction of false alarms, uh, gathering of data about what's going on with the system, who's testing it, when they're using it, for, wh whether it does in fact go off, um, and the ability to link to um, a communal system, not so that the um, communal areas will, uh, will, 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 sounders will go off in communal areas, but so that the fire and rescue service know what's going on in the building and can act accordingly. So it's not just a, a fire alarm, it's an, in, it's an integral system to give all the right information to the right amount of people at the right time. Yes, absolutely so. And um, if you look at the system up here, you can see that we've got the screen. This is in the cloud, as everything is these days. So you can, you can be a fire alarm, um, a, a, sorry, a building owner, and you can gather information to make sure that your tenants are actually testing their systems, whether there are problems with certain tenants, having lots and lots of false alarms, um, whether there are any real fires. You can measure all of this information and uh, actually make people safer by acting when there's a problem. And do you feel like, you know, as we've talked about many times here at FireX over the last couple of years, there have been disasters, there have been things that have gone wrong and it has, it's brought this industry to the forefront of a lot of people's conversation, which, which inevitably is a good thing. People are looking forward to solutions now. Is this one of those solutions? I think this is an important part of the solution. There's many things that have got to change in the way building regulations are, are, are handled, legal responsibility. We could go on for ages talking about those sorts of things, but this is a simple system that people can use in their own homes. It makes it easy for them to be safe and to feel safe. If, you, if there is a fire in a building at the moment, there isn't a fire alarm. Everybody leaves anyway, even though perhaps they don't need to. So what we're hoping with this system is that it will actually bring trust back to the residents of High Rise, that there is a way to protect them and that they can stay put, but if the fire develops, if it's a real fire and it develops, then they will be told in plenty of time so they can get out safely. Absolute pleasure. Thank you so much for chatting. Yeah.